David, commiserations. One apiece at half time. How do you feel the game got away from you in the end? Yeah, we came in. We came back into the game. Uh, disappointing goal to concede at the start of the game, but um, we came back in it. Fantastic strike from Gilfie. Uh, so we spoke at half time. We 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 had to make the change tactically because um, obviously Leighton Leighton went off. Um, but you just can't keep conceding goals the way we are from crosses and. You know, we've, we've got three centre-backs, we've got two centre-backs, you know, people get in between us and it's the manner of the goals that are killing us at the moment. How big a concern also was the lack of, overall, the lack of goal threat from you in this game? Well, like I said, we got back into the game with a great strike. Um, we missed Umar, you know, there's, there's, there's no getting away from the fact that we missed Umar on the ass today and uh, in my opinion he should have been on the field. Um, and, and things, you know, anything that's going, you know, going against us is is is, is having a big impact on us. So uh, injuries, you know, are killing us as well. So we we need to regroup, and um, you know, I can't stand here and, and defend the players today. Um, it was a totally unacceptable performance and a second half performance, and you know, the Everton fans are, are quite rightly going to be furious with that. But but so am I. Um, and it's it's not good enough. It's not good enough for our football club. Two home games coming up now in the space of the next few days. How do you lift the players again for those challenges? Well, it's a massive week for us. It's a massive week on the pitch. Um, you know, what happens off the pitch will be decided by other people. So um, we need to just come back in in the morning. We need to regroup. We need to do what we always do and go go through what we've done um, well and what we've done not so well. You know that what we've done well won't last very long, but. Um, we need to pick everybody up. The players have to take a responsibility. It's really important that senior players uh, take the responsibility of. And you know we're in a fight. You know we're in a fight, and the only the only way you get out of a fight, because I've been in a few few battles, is by standing up and be counted. You know you can't shirk your responsibilities. You have to stand proud, and you have to be together. And there's not enough of that at the moment. It's been a very frustrating few days for you personally. What what, what do you think you can bring now? to improve the fortunes of the team over these next couple of games? Well, we can lift the spirits again. Um, we need to um, try and pick a team, do our homework uh, for, the, for the games coming up. Um, if anything changes uh, between now and then, you know, that's fine. Um, but we all need to just take responsibility. I'll stand here and I'll take my responsibility. Absolutely not a problem. But the players have got to come with us. The players have got to come with the football club as well. And, um, you know, if... If players aren't ready to take that responsibility, well, well, we'll get players in who do. You say that certain decisions are obviously out of yours and the players' hands, but for the good of the club, do you feel a decision needs to be made sooner rather than later now, one way or the other? I do, yeah, I do. I think, um, I think it's got to a situation now where, um, you know, if, if any of the players are looking at the situation, uh, and making excuses, you know, uh, it now has to be, you know, it now has to be solved. If it's going to be me, fine. If it's not, well, then let's get somebody in as quick as possible. And um, you know that we need some, we need that to happen fairly quickly. So um, you know, I will back the board, whatever they decide to do, and um, you know, what's good for the, what, what, what's best for the football club, um, is what I want. David, appreciate your time. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.